to do this little moment. black and white so I tried I did this one this one here with sequins with black sequins and then at a time I'll show you sequins here here are sequins and I added one at a time with glue almost glue I did have black because my bathroom is black and white. And so that's why she's black scales because my bathroom is black and white. But this one here, I'm going to do her silver. Was she pretty hot she came out? It's a hook so you can put um, your puff puff and your puff puff, whatever you want in the bathroom. It already has a little hook in the back so you can hang it up. So these are the scales, the sequins I did one at a time. I painted out white and this part I painted black. Then we can paint out black. I have black. I have a little bit of the silver here. And a little hair. Yeah, I kind of like her. I'm going to match badge her a little while. Uh, a little while. Anyway, this one I want to do her in silver. And I have silver here. Sequence. So I'm going to I'm tightening all of them. I'm using the medium size because they come bigger too. So I'm gonna use these. First, I'm gonna paint her white. I'm gonna paint her all white. I want two of them. And I'll paint my buff puff and my brush. And bathroom brush. And this is so cute. My bathroom is a lot. I have a lot of mermaids in my bathroom. So it's like the fifth mermaid in my bathroom. I get this in the Dollar Tree. I thought they were cute. All you do is screw off. You screw it off. It comes out real, uh, real nice and easy. That is no problem. Taking off the little knob, the hanging knob. You want to wear two coats? Get a two coat. And give a three coats. 
I did the first one off of camera because I didn't know what I was going to do with her. And plus the sequins, it takes long, but I'm going to show you. After I decorate her, I'm going to half of it so you can see exactly what I did, how I glued it. And the rest I'll do it off camera because it'll take like forever to have to see me, but it's not really. Once you know how to do it, it's kind of, go kind of quick. So I painted her um, white, and then when I added her sequins here, I painted this black. And then I painted the silver. I can, but I really won't. I should, because the size is okay. I'll paint the silver, the tail. You're probably going to add silver to it. I go add her silver and black, which I'm thinking of doing, then just silver. I'm going to put my, um, my heat gun on because it's a little light. So I'm going to take my fan instead. My fan fan. And I'm going to dry out this one. I don't want to put the heat gun on because it's a little light. It makes noise. I use my hand fan and it should be good. Give it another coat because the body has to stay white. Let's see my silver paint. I'm just going to get one cup because I really don't need to make it look so, but the sequence is going to cover up. See the black? You don't, you don't see it on top, but you'll see it underneath, on the side. This is silver, metallic silver from, from home decor chalk, for art, and it's metallic silver. Okay. 
have to peel the paint underneath. Oh. I just needed to um, put my and give it one more coat to dry. I really don't need to coat that again. I'm gonna paint that silver. No cold on top.
use the facilities. Should do silver hair on her. I don't know why I painted it because I didn't paint this over. I don't know why I'm doing it. Silver for her hair. I know I painted this part. I should do black and silver. I think I'm gonna do black and silver. With the not black. One black and one silver. I just go in the other direction. Like a left and a right side. Oh. It's good, but everybody has that screw. I gotta hot glue this or cut it off. Yeah, I was going this direction. He yeah, has a little hole to cover the hole. Then 
mean, I don't really have to be fully covered. Okay, let's try this over here. I will be very careful with this one. This one is kind of thick. I don't really need to put on my my hiccup. I really need to dry this up. And the fanning is not working fast enough.
Okay. I think I put something out here. I'm gonna get one more coat. I think that's good. Let me see what I'm doing the sides. In the sides. Something like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't want something about it. I'm 
Mm -hmm. I want to do with them. I collect a little circle. Those. I just cut them off. A little. Okay, I want to take these. Mm -hmm. I got in the power tray. And then just been sticky doors, which is so good to have in your stash. So they come in handy. Yeah, I'm going to put some around my hair. I'm decorating this first because it feels can take some time. Oh, man. 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 Oh, the beginning I'm do so I think I'm gonna do this. the silver one I did the you know the big mermaid that she has the long one I did that with black suit I did a gold one and a silver and black one the gold one I gave to my sister Thank you. 
cut around it. So I said, brown people can't see the sticking. Like string. Oh my god, I can't I saw these in the pile of that in here. Those are so good for my, for my brush, my back brush to have. For my bus pass to hang on. Oh, I think that's enough. Okay, that's not overdo it. Okay, it's back. Yeah. I'm gonna give her one of the, a bracelet. Exactly, go around. You have to very carefully look at the cheese in the trash. Um, so that little shot on the wall. I glue it. She's really not sticking on it. These are sticky, they're not really, really sticking back. Okay. I got that. There's not very much you can, you can do with these. The next step, I want to not show you. Sequence. I'm using this one, World Bond Blue. It's white, but it dries clear. As you can see, it dries clear. You can also use um, Elmer's glue. Don't use um, hot glue because it's going to look messy. No, all that glue is showing. So use um, Elmer's glue. Or the one, the white one from um from the Dollar Tree. That's white. Okay, let me show you. See, it's white. I'm gonna 
gonna use a uh, um, tweezers. Yeah. Okay, and I'm gonna use very thin brush so I can put the glue on. Okay, all you gotta do is put the glue on where you wanna put it. And then you take one of your sequins and just place it on like that. Now you're going to overlap them. You're going to put a little bit of glue on top of this one. And you take another one. Another sequin. Then you put it on top of that one. Then you're going to make a line across like this. Very easy, just a little time consuming. And take your time. And you overlap it. Always put a little bit on top of the next one. Just a little. So hold the next one in place. Continue. Don't worry about the glue, the glue is not going to show. And show they're flat, not, in other words, not up. See, this one's flat like this, with it up, and this one's upside down. The sequence should be flat, not with this up going up. It's like, I don't know if you can see it. You see, this is up, and this is flat. So, make sure they're flat. <laughs> so when you put it on top of the other one, it's not up. It's not in the way it's going to land on top of it nicely. Put a little bit on the top. So use your fingers, but I like this one better. And go like that. Okay? Stop right there. The next line, you do the same thing. Okay, it's going to be on the side. Put glue on the side. It's just a little wide. That one, if it's upside down, just turn it around. See, turn it on, turn them around. And so they flat. Take the next one. That one turn on. And put it on top of that one. Ah. And do the same thing here. Now you got glue on the side. And a little bit on the other. That's what this one holds. And both sides. Well, I should learn how to do this. It's simple, very simple. You kind of speed, or speed up. And then you put some on the other ones, on top of the other ones. So the glue would grab the one you're gonna put on top. Okay. And carefully you move them. I mean they're gonna move. Just put them back in place. Guess we're gonna put a little bit more on the top. Because you're gonna run this stuff here. Around this hole here. Okay. And they're all turned around.
They're overlapping. That's what they're doing. They're just overlapping. That's what the third row do the same thing. How many rows you do depending on you? How far you put them apart, how close you put them. These also come in smaller sizes. I see one. No, I can't pick it up today. No, I get it. Try to make them stick. Okay. That means glue. Any glue that is going to dry clear. That was glue. Was just as good. So oh, that's okay and have a glue, don't worry about it. It'll dry clear, you won't see. Okay, I'm doing this end here. Putting a little bit on the other one. And put it in here. Let's see. I'm going to be off a little bit, but not much. I was going to use the, the ribbon that has the sequins. But it kind of wasn't working, you know. So I went back into... I'm doing a single, which could be more precise. They have this sequence um, and ribbon. I'm going to show you in a minute. Oh, come on. Let's put it on. Thank you. 
You hear my TV? Pretty sure I could feel some of my The sequence of like scales, that's why I like to use in the sequence. Because they remind me of scales. And it's shiny. Which works perfectly. Thank you. I don't know, today. I had that much trouble with the black one picking it up. And something I'll use my finger. I'm frustrated. And I'm going to do the same thing with her breast. To cover her breast, like yeah, I did with the black one. And see, I put a little on her breast. I'm gonna do the same thing here. Like this, I'm gonna put some glue here. Yeah, I'm gonna do it now so you can see. I'm gonna put three. We're gonna be on top of each other. Okay, turn on me. Yeah, on the top of it. Mm -hmm. Don't lose her. The shape of her breath. So you can put it on top. Also overlapping like this. They have this tiny little one here. Which I'm going to put it so I can cover this little hole here. I got to find the other ones. I think it's in the, in the bag in there. But they're so tiny that you got to find them. You got to find them in the bag. Like that. Let me see if I find the other little tiny one in here. I might, I might not find it. So let's see one. And where have I, I got these sequins? I think I got them in Amazon. 
They come in all different colors. Here's one. Those are coming different sizes. And one more. Okay, a little purple ones. I have them in all colors. Okay, here's another one here. Another tiny one. So I'm gonna put it on to cover a little hole. I'm gonna put some glue on top of this one. Grabbed it. It's very hard to pick up the little one. Okay, let's pick up this one. Okay. Alright, let's continue with my other one. Let's put this line. This is basically I mean this is also you could do match patch put a pretty napkin um and another one up here so many different ways you could just um paint these decorate them I'm using this for my hot tub, but not the one I'm using in the shower. The one I always have extra buff top and it's hanging on a hook. So I figured these were perfect for that. And my other things I have rope that I hang on hooks. And since I might Bathrooms mostly have uh, a lot of mermaids. And this was a, this was part. Once I have my lose it, I'm gonna be up in the air. Okay, this is going to be my last line that you're going to see me do. And then, when I'm finished, I'm going to put the picture up. But this is what I am, I'm actually going to finish doing. 
from this thing. Well, that's it. I'm gonna give her some. And she turned on me. Yeah, she gave me a hard time. Mm -hmm. Patience, yes, lots of patience. I'm in no rush to finish. I like to take my time. Because it would be all worth it in the end. Okay, guys, I will stop here in the video. It is taking quite long. And when I finish, I'm going to go all the way up to the tail like this one. See, okay? I'm just following the tail. And I go this way, and on this way, and go like this. And that's it. Basically, uh, she's almost finished. You <clears throat> see? So, we want to black one. And this is what it's going to look like. So, when I finish with it, I don't know if I'm going to leave the black. No, I'm going to paint the silver. I'm going to do this one silver. And that's what it's going to look like. Okay, because this is kind of long to do. So I did the first one so you can see the finishing, how it looks like when she's finished. Then then I'm going to take pictures so you can see. Okay? Bye, guys. Good night. Oh, sweet dreams. Um.